By the end of the 19th century, after generations of hard frontier living and sometimes violent interactions with the native population, the United States had firmly established itself in the Northwest. Many of the frontier forts and military bases in the area had outlived their usefulness. Therefore, Congress authorized funds for the construction of a military post in Spokane in 1896. The new post would replace the old and decaying Fort Spokane, Fort Walla Walla, and Fort Sherman in Coeur d'Alene. Residents of Spokane had high hopes for the new base, imagining it to be a financial boon for the area on the order of $20 per capita annually. Despite the hopes that Spokane citizens had for the fort, it never truly became a full-size regimental headquarters. Where once Spokaneites had imagined the fort would contain 125th of the entire U.S. Army, it only ever managed to house about 500 men. During World War II, the post was turned into a convalescence center for the U.S. Army Air Corps. After the war, Fort George Wright existed in a sort of limbo, for a while serving as housing for Air Force personnel. In 1957, the base was abandoned. In 1960, a portion of Fort George Wright's former grounds were taken over by the Sisters of the Holy Name Convent, who established Fort Wright College. In 1990, facing serious financial difficulties, the land was purchased by the Mukagawa Women's Academy, a Japanese girls' college which still manages the majority of the property to this day.